Some strange foods take the internet by storm, but leave you wondering exactly how or why you're supposed to eat them. It's not just the Instagram age that has seen all these weird fads popping up. For decades, the collective consciousness has been captivated by the next new thing when it comes to food, and some of it is just downright bizarre. Congealed salads There are a few words that should probably never be used to describe food, and congealed is one of them. But back in the 1930s, congealed salads were all the rage. You could put almost anything in a mold with some jello. Whether or not you actually should do it is another story. But it was the Great Depression, and people were looking for just a little bit of hope and sunshine wherever they could find it. If you thought congealed salads ended when the Depression did, you are sadly mistaken. Congealed salads graced the inside of cookbooks in the 1960s and 70s as well. To give your salads a holiday look, start with Jell-O. Even weirder, they seem to be making a comeback today, with everything from SpaghettiO aspects with Vienna sausages in the center to Jell-O molds filled with everything but the kitchen sink floating around on Instagram. Be wary of anything called a surprise loaf at the next event you attend, but honestly, that could describe any of these dishes. Mm. Glitter Coffee Glitter, even edible glitter, isn't new. But it wasn't until 2017 that news broke that coffee shops had started using edible glitter to jazz up their cappuccinos. Now Instagrammers are even adding edible glitter to their coffee at home. Why? Because it's all about the presentation. Information on whether or not the glitter gets stuck in your insides as relentlessly as it gets stuck everywhere else isn't included in the menu description. Freeze-dried astronaut food for decades, it didn't get any cooler than being an astronaut. We were obsessed with the idea that we could blast into space and float among the stars. So it's not entirely surprising that once we figured out we didn't even have to leave Earth to eat like an astronaut, we were totally down with that. You should try Space Food Sticks for good nutrition and lasting energy in a chewy, tasty snack food. According to Gizmodo, it was in the 1960s that mass media was running with the idea that freeze-dried astronaut food was going to be the way of the future. It was space-saving, economical, and efficient. Even better, it was cool. If you didn't have freeze-dried ice cream at least once during your childhood, you were seriously missing out. And you need to get some. This particular trend may not have taken off like the media predicted, but you can still pick up some freeze-dried foods just for nostalgia's sake. Or, you know if you're a doomsday prepper. One of my favorites is, is freeze-dried chicken. I love this. I mean, this is, this is the ultimate high-tech prepper food. Rainbow and Galaxy Foods Thanks to social media, we're developing all kinds of food trends that hinge on appearance rather than just on taste. Take a quick glance and you'll definitely find some rainbow food. While there are some things that seem like they were made to be turned into rainbow-inspired creations, others maybe not so much. There's rainbow burgers, rainbow sushi, rainbow grilled cheese, rainbow bagels, rainbow pizza, and even rainbow hot dogs. If savory rainbow food isn't your thing, just look at the trend of galaxy-themed desserts. They look amazing, and they include everything from cake and cookies to candy apples and lollipops, all decorated to look like something that was plucked right out of the night sky. Between rainbows and your very own starry night, this all brings us to a very, very important question. What will future generations think when they see your Instagram? No way! Cheese tea. Quick, think of two types of deliciousness that should absolutely never, under any circumstances, be mixed together. If you said cheese and tea, you'd probably agree with a ton of people. But another ton swear it's the best thing since sliced bread. Ooh! I actually like it. I do. <laughs> you never thought this would taste like this. According to The Independent, this particular trend started in Taiwan. To be more precise, it's iced tea topped with whipped cheese. Does that clarification make it any better? We're not sure. The trend started by using powdered cheese and moved on to incorporate whipped cream cheese. It started to spread outside of Asia by hitting the US and the UK first. Considering how seriously the Brits take their tea, this is pretty much blasphemy. Deep fried everything. There are a lot of incredibly important discoveries that have been made over the course of mankind's existence, and the discovery that you can deep fry pretty much anything set a massive precedent for American food trends in the 21st century. Are we proud of this? We're not sure. But you have to admit the fact that you can deep fry soda is pretty impressive. Huh? Look what you did! Also on the list of surprisingly friable foods are pizza, Reese's peanut butter cups, Oreos, cheesecake, apples, moon pies, cupcakes, jelly beans, starfish, tarantulas, seahorses, and more bugs than you'd be comfortable thinking about. Also, deep-fried beer ravioli are a thing, too, and that's definitely important. Hey, hey, Billy, can you deep-fry the shoes? Hey, no problem, got nothing to lose! Thanks for watching. Click the mashed icon to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Plus, check out all this cool stuff we know you'll love too.